what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel welcome back to the another video and it's been almost 24 hours and i think it's a perfect time to talk about how the day went in terms of battery life and the performance so i will be showing battery stats and i will be showing geekbench score over here of ios 26 developer beta 5 and i've been testing out throughout my day i also did a real world test day in the live video that video will come on my other channel that is the ios live so you know go to the channel and check out that video too if you want to enjoy the day in the life video in that video it also tested out the pubg mobile so you can have a better idea about the performance but in this video i'm going to talk about straight facts i'm going to talk about the battery life first let me get into the battery life battery life stats over here um not over here there's a battery test stats load view battery life usage so i used around 66 percent of my battery life as you can see and against that, I got 4 hours and 15 minute screen on time. Now, this is decent. I was also using LTE throughout my day along with the Wi-Fi sometimes. And I was like using different applications. For example, I was quite active on YouTube, PUBG Mobile, Photos, Threads, and some other applications as you can see. I was also using the app to record snaps on Snapchat. So yeah, I used as much as I could. And I'm not able to drop it to the 0% as you can see it's still more than 40% so yeah battery life is decent like I do believe if I go around 90% of usage I will easily get more than 6 hours which is a really good screen on time for this much old device this is iPhone 11 running iOS 26 developer beta 5 so in terms of battery life I'm pretty much satisfied again I think there is slight room to get a better but you know I will be able to talk about the battery life um, after a few days in a much better way because it's just 24 hours that I'm testing out. Sometimes first 22 of 24 hours are great. Sometimes they are not. So definitely after using it for like a couple of days, I will be able to you know talk about battery life in a much better way. So I will be breaking more videos regarding that. But so far things seem nice. I want to talk about the Geekbench. Definitely, I'm going. I will go over here into the Geekbench app. And, you know, I ran multiple tests. Let me talk about the CPU history first. So I ran a test after updating to this update. And it was like 1770 on a single core and 3776 on a multi-core. So these cores are decent. They are higher than the average ones. Slightly higher than the average ones. But I was not satisfied with the score. So I ran the score again after using my device for, you know, a couple of hours. And this time I got a much better score. 1794 on a single core and 4141 on a multi-core. Multi-core this time is quite high. It's one of the best multi-core score, which is a really good sign, which means it seems it is better, you know, performing in a much better way. I also ran the GPU score over here because some people are there who do care about the GPU score. So it was 3795 metal score that is higher than the average one. So again, scores are decent, they are good. And also I'm feeling it's smoother than the previous beta. And, you know, I'm enjoying it more than the previous beta, being very honest. It feels really smooth. It feels really better, which is a really, really, really good sign. So, yeah, it feels much better. Definitely, there are different changes. I talk about those changes in my one of the previous videos. If you haven't watched that video, go to my channel and check out that video. Uh, when the public beta 2 update will come out, I will definitely test out that update too. But I will be testing that update on the iPhone 16. So, yeah, that's the thing i want to share so yeah that's all from this video i just wanted to talk about the performance just wanted to share how the thing is going on and how i am experienced overall if i conclude this video battery life i am 100 percent satisfied performance i am 100 percent satisfied and i think overall in terms of battery life and the performance this is a really good update and i hope to catch you guys in my next video until the day care peace out